So guys, in my latest guide on YouTube, you might have seen it. 10.2 guide. It's still mostly up to date, but there's one thing, one huge thing that actually changed. And that is the build that I play in solo shuffle. And I would say in 99% of my, my shuffles now, I play this new build and not the old build. So I'm going to go through the, the difference in the builds, showcase how it works. And then also like, you know, opener, rotation, burst, those kind of things. What is going on here is that you can see we still have a cleave build. We have Primal Wrath, but the differences on this one and my old one are these talents. We're not going for full bleeds. Instead, we're going for some huge bites. Double Saber Dross and also double Carnivore's Instincts. So this build is like very, very fun in this way too because it merges kind of two playstyles into one. So Saber Dross is the, the, the main difference. And it's huge in your play style because with, with the old clay build, you would rip or prime ref rather and then reapply it. Like only spam reapply rip. You would only bite when Apex Predator procced. You know? With this build is different. It's quite different. You actually don't even play Apex Predator. But you, you bite. Like you actually finish with bites a lot of the time. Bleeds are only really used to buff your bites. It's kind of how I... I would view it. So if you have full full bleeds up, you're not going to reapply rip and uh, get the value out of Terrapin Wounds or like rip and tear. Instead, you're going to bite. So I'm going to show right now example of this. So I'm going to kind of do my opener now. So let's say I open up. Rake. Frowl Frenzy. Rip. Now we're not playing Circle of Life and Death. And I'm going to spam bite. You're going to bite all the way. Keep reprocking Blood Talents as well. Keep biting. And now that it fades, you reapply. In the old build, it was like this. You would just Primal Wrath. Primal Wrath. Like this, right? And I would say, like, that's the main difference. So, if you practice the old build, just keep keep that in mind. That you uh, want to bite now instead of reapplying always. That's, like, the, the biggest thing for me that, that, that was kind of tough to um, get used to. Because I was so used to spamming, spam reapplying bleeds that I, that, that I was not biting enough. If you bite more, you can do a lot more damage. And keep in mind, also with Sabertooth, when you bite, all your rips will do more damage for about four seconds, I think. Yes, four seconds. So when you bite, your bleeds do 25% more damage. Your rip does. So try to keep the uptime of that as high as possible as well. Okay, now for the honor talents. So with this build, usually it's going to be the same honor talents as in the old clip build. You can go with Wild Attunements, Wicked Claws, and King of the Jungle. You still spread bleeds. Like, bleeds is still a pretty good part of it. Um, and you still get, you know, that the nice extra healing. And I'm playing this build recently. It gotten quite high with it. But... It's not all about biting, guys. You gotta remember clone. Clone is a major, major part of this as well. Okay. Landing clones is unbelievably important for Feral right now. So as you're biting and doing your damage, you wanna try to land as many clones as possible. I, I, I can't clone the uh, dummies, but land as many clones as possible on whatever, whatever you can and free bites more. Which, of course, can give you 20% or 10% more damage in PP on everything. So, you pretty much want to combine these things. Your Cyclone and Tear Set value for extra damage. More Fell Frenzies, which also counts as a bleed uh, that helps bite. 5%. I'll show, like, one more kind of whole kind of go uh, and everything now. Combine it. So, I'm going to open up. Incarn, Rip, Frog Frenzy, just spread those bleeds. You, you might also like notice when I actually use Heart of the Wild, because it's not coming yet. You want to do that like when Incarn ends usually. Pretend this is a shuffle, okay? 
So as Incarn is ending, you use one of hearts and also start cloning. Like when you're actually in Incarn, cloning isn't really necessary. It's more about just spamming bites and bleeds. Mainly bites. Now the Incarn ends, you want to heart, start landing clones. And, and just keep it going. And of course, in an actual arena, they're going to stop you and kill you at the same time. But this is the, the general idea. And then, once your heart ends, your Incarn is soon going to be off cooldown again, and then rinse repeats. Uh, usually, you're only going to do one heart in a game. But, yeah. You get the point. Like, just that kind of opener is going to be so insane for you in shuffles. And then you guys can see my stats with this uh, build and everything. We're mainly playing with... Let me type for a piece you can see. Uh, a lot of mastery. A good amount of haste as well. And minimal crits. You can see my uh, exact gear and armory, if you guys want to see that. That's linked under. And uh, yeah. That's like a mini guide on this new build. Again, it's like a very similar playstyle to the old build. So if you watch my, my old guide, uh, you'll still uh, learn like a lot. Uh, but this one is way more bites. That's the main thing. Bites instead of reapplying bleeds all the time. To sum it up. And then all the, the, the other things I said combined with that. The most simple way to put it is basically... Maintain as many bleeds as possible to get value out of taste for blood. Keep blood talents proct. And do a lot of bites when bleeds are up. And then adding on that gets your value out of your two set and uh clones, right? That's when like it becomes a bit more advanced like really good ferals will get high value out of cyclones and your two sets um that's like a thing that that really separates but it's like knowing when when to cyclone i see many ferals on like a bit low rating they try to do so many um like clones in incarn like they'll open up incarn and start cloning and trying to fake cast it's like dude do damage you know yeah, and like, your Incarn is just ticking out. And, and, and you're just trying to Cyclone. It's like, you gotta pump damage. You know, you, you know Kinvi? Yes, I do, I do, man. 